By funding as many projects as possible, uh, research funded by Diabetes UK has the potential to improve the quality of, of life of people with diabetes. We all need to work together, people with diabetes, clinicians, scientists uh, and of course Diabetes UK to try and find better ways how to uh, prevent and manage diabetes. The Charcot foot is a bone and joint complication in people with diabetes which can be set off by simple trauma like uh, tripping on the curb or running after the bus uh, and this can lead to fractures. These fractures take very long time to heal, may lead to collapse of the foot and deformity. A kidney disease is one of the major complications that occur in patients with diabetes and basically what happens is the high glucose and elevated blood pressure causes a, um, an effect on the small blood vessels that occur in the kidney. And the normal job of these vessels is actually to filter the blood and to remove any waste products that there are. So when the, these vessels actually go wrong, like, like, like happens in diabetes, the blood, the blood vessels become leaky. And, and gradually as you get more exposed to the high glucose and the elevated blood pressure, the, you actually get fibrosis and inflammation in the kidney and gradually this causes um, end stage renal disease. Our work is interested in finding new molecules and, and new drugs that can actually prevent this leakage of, of protein into the urine. And this is potentially that we'll have new early treatments for patients with diabetes. We know that bone making cells do not work very well in people with diabetes. What we have in the shark of what we have severe bone destruction and at the same time we don't have ad adequate bone repair. And um, this is what we really try to overcome.